Welcome back. Welcome back. I am uh, doing a little something different other than the chest mount. I got the helmet mount. It's been a while, but uh, hey, just changing it up a little bit. Just making sure no one's behind me. A little different ride with the uh, handlebar mount, the chest mount, and the helmet mount. All different rides. So you'll see what I'm looking at, hopefully. Ooh. Windy out here, headwind. Winds have shifted or it's shifting, constantly shifting. I don't know what that guy was doing. Oh, whoa, oh. car accident about to happen. Let's get going. Let's get going before someone kills me out here. Yeah, this is the stuff that I have to deal with. All right. So just a little quick in and out. Went to the clubhouse, had my nutritional drink. Wow, look at all these houses. They are building them as fast as they can uh, get the materials. Look at these houses on this side. Yeah, whoa, some of those houses look huge. Huge. Over there, wow. Anyways, let's concentrate on the road. Some debris in the road right there. I don't know what that is. Uh, looks like a plastic uh, pot, flowering pot, disposable. Okay, headed on home. Just going to do a quick ride. I don't know how many rides I'm going to do. I mean, this is a week before winter break. And it's forecasted to rain, actually. It's overcast today. Forecasted to almost slight, small chance of raining today, but I doubt it. But it's going to maybe chance, chance of rain this week. So I'm just trying to get a ride in. It's supposed to be cold, but it feels very humid. Feel warm, or maybe I've gotten acclimated to the uh, the cold 60 degrees, 65, 67, sometimes 70, low of 50, maybe a low of 40. That's cold for me. I'm not used to that kind of weather. There's a car behind me. There's the high school right there. where my oldest is my youngest will maybe go there one day so yeah all this is going to uh, hopefully go to college hopefully who knows Anyway, she's going to graduate uh, 2022. My mom will be coming to live with us. And I don't know if I'm going to do RVing or not. Uh, just a lot of stuff in the air, you know, like, that's the plan. We like to do some RVing, get a trailer, get a vehicle. But the problem is there's a shortage of cars, trucks. There's just a shortage of automobiles and then uh, a shortage of materials to make travel trailers. Just any, anything, anything with a vehicle, there's just a shortage of even an electric bike. So just not too uh, sure if this is going to be possible for us or not. Getting their car towed. Looks like it. Triple A. Looks like Triple A service. So, 
Yeah, helmet mount. I like it. It's it's a little different. It's a little different. At least you get to see what I'm looking at or the direction I'm looking at. I did check the tires and they look like they're at, they have full pressure. So whatever I ran over, man, I'm, it was kind of scary when you hear a large, a large pop. So check the tires. Oh, fall riding. This is fall riding for me. Looks like uh, summer riding for some of you people. Or it looks like San Francisco. <laughs> looks like San Francisco right now, right? Overcast, kind of foggy-ish, no sun in the middle of the afternoon. People got to drive with their headlights on. The only thing I don't like about wearing the uh, the camera, the camera that I have, I look like a Teletoby. I have that uh, that 360 camera. It's a vert it looks vertical. It's not your GoPro type square, but. <laughs> I look like a Teletoby. Add some weight to it. Add some weight to the helmet, so it feels kind of weird when I when I move around. But it's not that heavy, thank goodness. I'm not. I don't have like a DSLR DSLR camera on my head. Make sure I tighten my helmet. I didn't even tighten my helmet. Oh my god. Okay, now my helmet's on. Silly me. Oh, making good time. Another video on the Rad Rover, everybody. these popping noises it scares me all right gonna just let all the cars go by there's no point in me uh, trying to uh, cross someone's gonna have a green light here soon uh, looks like the left turning lane having a green light. As you get closer to uh, the holidays, I mean, there's just more traffic. And uh, we'll see how the rest of the week goes if I ride anymore. If I... Just go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, lady. Just let them go first. Because uh, everybody is always in a hurry at this time of year. Watch out, car. Watch out, watch out. Everyone's always at a, in a hurry at this time of year. Always in a hurry. So. They all want to go someplace. They need to do it now. They're already late. Maybe a bad time to ride a bike, actually, or a skateboard, or whatever, or be a pedestrian walking around. I personally don't like it. Holiday season, drunk season, that's what I call it, <laughs> holiday season. Holiday season is drunk season. A lot of accidents. Whew, I'm just going to cruise. I'm going to cruise down this, just coast. Man, I am, I am getting warm. Good thing I didn't wear a... Uh... Good thing I didn't wear a jacket. So I got my lights on, my tail lights on. I think I'm good. Slow down here just a little. There we go. Do the little jump. Uh, this is my exercise. Yeah. 
I've been, uh, when it does rain out here or when I don't ride my bike, I do use an electric muscle stimulator called Compact Sport Elite. Mostly on my legs. It's a major muscle group, so get to still have some uh, physical activity without uh, going out or exerting any effort. Still train those muscles. Your muscles really keep your body together for the most part, other than, of course, your your ligaments, but uh, slow down. Watch out for this bent railing. Watch out for oncoming cars. They really drive fast this time of year. Drive fast this time of year. Ooh. They are clearing out the brush right here. Uh, that tells me they're building more commercial property, most likely. So. I might take the off-road. Nice. The ground is pretty dry, solid, not too muddy. It did rain a couple days ago. The thing about the winter time is, you know, I always say I'm gonna go off roading during the winter time because I can wear, I can gear up, wear my boots. But it's always too warm, and it also rains, and then the ground doesn't dry fast enough. It stays moist and soggy. It's not ideal. There we go. I'll go ahead and take the. Uh, just cut right through. The grass is cut. The grass stops growing about this time of year, which is nice. So, don't get any uh, rolling resistance and any seeds go up on my shoes. Oh, oh, oh. I'll make it up here. Oh, yeah. Now we take it easy here. That's why I don't have bar end mirrors. That's why I don't have bar in mirrors, you know, fit in some, got to squeeze through some tight uh, access points, so you can still make it. You would have to like, you know, you would have to turn your handlebars, do a little zigzagging with your handlebars. Off-road trail. Now you get to see what I see, although you see what I see anyway, but let's have a look here. That's the levee. I don't see any alligators. That's the high school over there, if you can see from the, the tree. Oh, not the high school, that's the middle school. I'm telling you, the middle schools are like, the football fields at, at middle schools look like high school football fields in California. <laughs> and then the, the, uh, the, the community colleges are at the high school football fields look like community college football fields in California. It's only when you go up to the university level, like, you know, university, university, that you actually get a real football field out of California. For students, you know. Student schools. I'm not, that's what I'm talking about. Not, not professional. Look at these homes. They're in the gated area. Wow, look at that. That guy has an outdoor shower right there. <sighs> Anyways, doesn't matter for me. That's too much of a house for me, to be honest. Like, what would I do? Who would I invite? <laughs> you know, I don't have that many friends and I don't socialize too much. If I had a house like that, I wouldn't be making videos. So, hey, aren't you glad I don't have a house like that? All right, let's make it home, everybody. Make it home. Oh, my legs feel good. You know, using that muscle stimulator helps keep my uh, legs toned. And, uh, I'm not really feeling tired. You know, 
usually I would, uh, sometimes you get a little fatigued or maybe a little pumped in the legs because they're being overexerted. I don't feel that because I've been using uh, the muscle stimulator. So, mostly on my legs. It's easy, you know, I just lay down, put the electrodes, put the electrodes, or put those uh, electric pads on the legs, just lay there half an hour watching some YouTube, and it's like I got a, got some decent workout without breaking a sweat. It just helps keep, keeps my muscle tone. Don't want to lose your muscle mass. When you get older, you lose a lot of muscle mass. You atrophy. So, don't want to do that. At the same time, I don't want to drive to the gym. Uh, the, where I live, they have a gym here. I could ride my bike, but, you know, I'm just trying to avoid... I'm trying to avoid places and people, especially with the uh, Omicron COVID-19 variant running around. I think in a couple more weeks, maybe, maybe into the new year, January, it's gonna, it's gonna make its big wave out here in America. It's already, it's already catching on around here. People are already catching the uh, Omicron. I think it's just a matter of time. Supposedly everybody's gonna get it. I'm, I'm watching, I'm watching it. I'm looking at South Africa or, or Southern African nations. Uh, Europe, Great Britain, just monitoring it around here. Man, I'm feeling good. I feel pumped. I'm getting a biker's high right now. I've been pedaling, and man, it feels good. Keeping up with the cadence. I don't know how fast I'm going, but as long as you just use your legs to push, that's all I really want. And I'm getting some resistance. I'm keeping up with the cadence. That's a, oh, just had a leaf hit my glasses. You gotta watch out for that on winter riding. The stuff falling from the trees. Wear some safety glasses so it doesn't hit your eye. If there's no cars behind me, I'll cheat a little bit. Cut through the shortcut. If there's no cars behind me, sometimes they are. Uh, I don't see that many cars. Okay. I only see one car. Okay, just making sure. I want to get a visual turn around. Okay, coming out. Oh, there's one car behind me. cars behind me. All right. Oh. That worked out. Okay. Oh. Take the shortcut. Oh, so much Chick-fil-A drink is out here. Take it up here. Still on pedal assist 5, gear 7. Getting a good workout. Okay, just gotta watch out for all this. Christmas decorations are up. Everybody's in a joyful mood. We got their signs out. Anyways, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Consider joining membership. Until next time, everyone. Bye-bye.